So, this is the finale. The last moments afterwards, obviously, we will get drunk together, but for now we want to behave. Um, before we get to uh, the nomination of the winners, I would like to give our sponsor, Stefan from SKW Schwarz, the opportunity to say a few words. He's the one sponsoring the open bar, so listen carefully. <laughs> Thank you, Stefan. Hello, Berlin. <laughs> Woo! I am completely thrilled by what you have been doing in the last 24 hours. You know, I was completely inspired by the vibes we've had here, and it's completely cool to see how, if, how what happens if different groups are coming together. Because that's what we all want to do: develop legal services and get rid of Anwalt's hocus pocus. So without further ado, you know, we are a law firm. I'm coming from a law firm, so um, that's what we try to do at our law firm. We have different offices in Germany, including Berlin and Munich. So if you are interested in developing the future of the legal landscape, get in contact with us, because we are taking legal tech seriously. We've actually founded a legal tech entity in order to bring that mindset to lawyers. And from my practice, I know that this sometimes can be difficult. We're not, uh, we're not a, a boohoo firm building up huge teams but we are rather have a hands-on mentality. So we are trying to really to find the solutions and we know that sometimes it's boring, sometimes it's a lot of work, uh, but if we are at able at the end to find a sexy solution, that's what we want to do. And we want to have fun in the work that we're doing, so it's no wonder that we are very proud to be the sponsor of today, today's um, drinks. And so now, without further ado, <coughs> it's the three most important places that could have been taken today, and I hand over over to the jury. Let me just discreetly hand the jury the checks. First, I also would like to say thank you to all the members of this great event. We had a lot of fun. Um, it was the first time for me here on a hackathon. So start with a place number three. I would like to congratulate to team your presentation and um, we think there's a lot of uh, potentials on your project and so we are looking forward to see more about your, yeah, your you. <laughs> I'm sorry, <laughs> okay. Thanks. And the second place goes to Hate Speech Online. <laughs> Come up here, guys. Congrats. And we very much liked um, your enthusiasm. I think we, you had a great topic. Um, we are um, interested to see how this will develop, but the uh, um, work you've been doing, including the plugin that you've been developing over the last 24 hours, really was impressive. So very much um, earned and deserved. Congratulations. first place <laughs> of course when when I hit this room and I saw all these creative potential here <laughs> I was so thrilled really you all deserve this first place really and uh, a big applause first of all to you all guys <laughs> Yeah, 
but at least on this stage it can be only one one team and um, yeah without spoiling I say I think it's probably probably the end of every good bachelorette party on earth <laughs> <laughs> distinction <laughs> It was an amazing presentation and uh, yeah, a very good idea you had. You bring on the stage with, uh, you know, <laughs> an uncommon lot firm. <laughs> and yeah, thank you so much for participation and um, I'll give it back to you. <laughs> Thank you very much to the teams. Thank you very much to the jury. Um, you did a great job. Thank you very, very much. Um, I think we learned one very basic fact that is somewhat surprising, somewhat non-surprising. Even in the 21st century, sex sells. <laughs> so congratulations to the extinction. Uh, you deserve it. Uh, I think you did a great job even using the space using everything you have here. Uh, you created an Instagram account, you glued pictures everywhere, so I think this is what impressed the jury, among other things. You leveraged what you had at your disposal, so congratulations, that's deserved. Well, my friends, that is it. Um, we spent two amazing days together. Um, I hope to see many of you again next year. Um, I hope all of you that uh, had their first hackathon experience are inspired, are going to visit many more hackathons, are maybe going to quit their job on Monday and say, you know, fuck it, I want to be a legal tech innovator. Uh, I'm going to join SKV or something else. Um, so, um, yeah, I hope you were inspired. For those of you who don't want to wait a whole year to do their next hackathon, I want to quickly pitch a project that uh, we've been working on uh, at the Legal Tech Center. It's called the Legal Tech Bounty Network. It's an awful name, but um, it says what it is. And it's a website, it's online right now. You can go there, it's a .com domain and legaltechbountynetwork.com and you can sign up and we want to post bounties there from companies that are looking for solutions that sit in your brains and only in your brains. And you can uh, basically earn money by solving challenges online. If that interests you, go there, sign up. We might send you an email about it uh, as well. And with that, I want to close it off. Thank you very much. Please enjoy the open bar and see you again next year. Give yourselves a big round of applause and thank you very much. <laughs> Also für mich war es eine sensationelle Veranstaltung, also es kamen unterschiedliche Impulse aus Ecken, wo ich jetzt gedacht habe, also wäre ich in 100 Jahren nicht drauf gekommen. Auf dieser Konferenz gibt es die Möglichkeit, wirklich offen miteinander umzugehen und neue Gedanken auszuprobieren, äh, auch Fehler zu machen, äh, was auch im Rechtsbereich eher untypisch ist, zumindest noch momentan. Ähm, und ich erhoffe mir gerade für unsere Generation, dass wir dadurch wesentlich kollaborativer werden. Wir sind den Menschen, die sich für unseren Hackathon anmelden und zwei Tage Zeit nehmen, sich da voll äh, ähm, reinzugehen, abzutauchen, ähm, zu brainstormen, aber dann auch zu hacken und zu entwickeln. Unfassbar dankbar, weil die machen dieses Event wirklich zu dem, was es ist. Wenn mich jemand fragt, was ist eigentlich spannender, die Konferenz oder der Hackathon, würde ich immer sagen, der Hackathon, weil dort wird wirklich die Zukunft erschaffen. Auf der Konferenz diskutieren wir sie und deswegen halte ich den Hackathon für ja, mit die schönste äh, Seite unseres Events.